I stacked my boards the way that I wanted it to look and then began tracing out the lines that I wanted to use my jigsaw to cut out later. Sorry for the shaky picture, but here's a little bit of the jigsaw work and here's the finished product. Once all the pieces are cut, I'll need to sand every piece before putting them all together. Just like a jigsaw puzzle, I'll begin finding the pieces and laying them together. Here's the top two layers. The next layer that I'll be putting together is the bottom layer. Once that's nice and square, then I'll take the top layers and lay it on, step back and see if this is exactly what I want. Next, I'll pre-stain all my pieces. Here I'm staining the pumpkin in a Minwax Classic Gray. Next, I'll stain the stem in a special walnut by Minwax as well. It's time to assemble the pumpkin using wood glue these extra large clamps that'll push the glue and the pieces together and hold them real tight. All I have to do is line it up, screw it in, and hope, oh, nope, then that happens. Well, now for round two, let's try this again. Put the clamp on, screw it in, and hold it nice and tight. Once the backing is screwed in, the next thing I want to do is add a piece of uh, wood to the bottom. I've got to check that my pumpkin and my base are square. Once I know that they're square, it's time to begin nailing the two pieces together. Now I'm going to attach the two layers using wood glue as an extra adhesive, and then I'll be using my nail gun to attach the two. the nail went completely through. I was trying to hit all three of those. So here I go, gotta slowly pull the nail out. The pumpkin is almost done. I wanted to add a little bit of extra touches to the front by using a little bit of the special walnut stain to add a little highlight. It's time to seal this project with a little bit of polycrylic. Add a little burlap bow to the top. I just made this using a little bit of twine, some burlap, and a black and white ribbon. Thanks so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this project. See you again soon.